All right, everybody on the same page in the handout packet. So again, the name of this session is how to work less, produce more, and still get the job done in a sensible school week. What we're going to be talking about today is how to produce a breakthrough in your time, your results, and your satisfaction. That is working less, less hard, less effort, less hours, while increasing performance results in your schools and in your districts. And then increasing your personal satisfaction in the matter as well, because it's not okay with us for you to have fantastic results and be miserable in the process. We want you to be satisfied. So what do I mean by a breakthrough? If you refer to the diagram, in general, if you look at most organizations, schools included, you will see that their results tend to be increasing, albeit slowly, incrementally, generally in an upward direction, usually at a rate of about 5 to 15% per year. And that's what we call the drift of an organization. If you don't touch it, you don't play with it, you don't interfere, it just let it drift. And then something happens, and you get this non-linear, non-incremental shot upwards, the part depicted in the circle, unlike the normal drift. This is the phenomenon we're going to be talking about today. We define a breakthrough as a significant increase in results in a relatively short period of time that don't drift backwards over time. They sustain themselves at the new level after whatever the intervention was. You can produce a breakthrough in anything you can measure. And when an organization's focus is on producing breakthroughs, it is not uncommon to see 100, 200, 300, 400 percent improvement in any variable that you're measuring in a year's time or less. But you can imagine, right, what it takes to produce this is far different than what it takes to produce the drift. So let's take a look at what it, what it takes. To cause a breakthrough requires two major shifts. The first shift is a shift or change in action. Results are a derivative of action. Nothing happens or changes in the world until somebody takes action. And so breakthrough results come from taking dramatically different actions than you've taken in the past, which then begs the question, well, what impacts action? Which is the second shift that needs to occur, which is a shift in perspective. When a person's perspective shifts, when the way they've been viewing the same situation suddenly changes, they very naturally see different actions to take, often the ones that are going to cause breakthroughs. If you want to shift your results in a big way, if you're interested in producing breakthroughs in any area in your life, you've got to start by shifting how you see the world. And for all of you, we've got to start by shifting how you see the role of what we call school executive. 